Over on the campus of UTA, they're building uh, their, it's a building there that houses more than 200,000 reptile and amphibian specimen, all collected in jars of formaldehyde. Photojournalist Mike Kinney takes us inside to learn how one snake that's been on the shelf more than 40 years just got a new name. This has become known as the Amphibian and Reptile Diversity Research Center. So we're now the largest uh, collection uh, in Texas. We have a very active research program here. Okay. My name is Jonathan Campbell. I'm a professor of biology. I've been at UTA for uh, 37 years. Recently, we did describe not only a new species, but a new genus. We'd known about this snake for uh, well over 40 years, uh, but it was taken out of the stomach of a coral snake. This is one of the type cabinets. This cabinet contains uh, species that are, were all new to science. This particular jar contains the type specimen and only known specimen of Synaspis enigma, which is the, the new species that we described. The name is Synaspis enigma, which uh, simply means dinner snake because it was uh, eaten by the coral snake, and enigma means uh, mysterious. So it's kind of the mysterious dinner snake. That, as you can see, it's very small, about 10 inches or so, I think. But it is a very interesting snake. It's so different from anything. There's just nothing in this hemisphere, actually, that looks anything like it. We got up into this very remote area of Mexico. It's called the Chimalapas. So this was 1976. And over the years, I've been back into that area at least a dozen times. But I've never found another one of the snakes. Uh, it's always exciting to find something and think, you know, no one has ever seen this before. It doesn't even have a scientific name. I've described about uh, 200 new species of amphibians and reptiles in my career. This has probably got more response than most. And Dr. Campbell says finding a snake inside of a coral snake is not unusual. Yeah, he said out of the 10 coral snakes they found back in 1976, seven had another snake in the belly. Uh, mysterious dinner snake. The name is very appropriate. I'm freaked out by it.